Hello, today we are going to examine the connection between Raspberry Pi and ESP32 via UART. So basically we'll send a UART message from the Python program installed on the Raspberry Pi 3 and uh, receive this UART message on the ESP32 running ESPIDF uh, 5.0. Uh, in order to do so, we connected two, two pins. The first one is the uh, pin number 8 with TX out uh, transmission from the Raspberry Pi, which is GPIO 14, and the uh, ground, and on the ESP32 side, we connected GPIO, GPIO 3, pin number 14, which is RXD0. On the more uh, details team, you can see that this point, which is TX in the Raspberry Pi is connected to RX here on the ESP32 and they have a common ground. Uh, as we have mentioned, uh, on the Raspberry Pi we will run a Python program when on the ESP32 it will be a C with ESP IDF 5.0 environment, basically the free RTOS. A few words regarding our resources. First, we 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 used uh, the a page which explains the UART connectivity in the expressive site, where we have pretty elaborate explanations. Some of them were changed. For example, here some some. Uh, uh, parameters were changed and the program that we use is basically the same program which we use to receive a UART string f in the ESP 4.4 environment. But anyway, this is our uh, UART uh, resources regarding the ESP um, data. Regarding the Py Python file on Raspberry, 5, Ras Raspberry 3, Raspberry Pi 3, I found a very interesting uh, site, which you can see here, which explained in very good details how you can uh, send the UART from the Raspberry Pi to, uh, to different uh, um, boards. Here you have an introduction to uh, ex explanation for different UARTs going out from Raspberry Pi. Uh, we use those connections. An installation of UART in the uh, Raspberry config uh, options, which we performed. And also a pretty, pretty good explanation how you can uh, see which which uh, serial connection is defined with your Raspberry Pi? In my case, it was TTY S0, and also we perform this check with the USB to serial converter and PuTTY on my PC just to uh, make sure that the Raspberry Pi sending the correct uh, um, UART communication. And basically, we simplified the following uh, following Python file. I uh, strongly encourage you to read this uh, uh, site. As always, we have inside Sims IoT devices, or our code is uh, saved. In this case inside the uh, repository FreeRTOS ESP IDF 5 Raspberry Pi 3. When we added, in addition to the previous example that we was uh, related to the analog uh, signal from Raspberry Pi to ESP32, we are talking now regarding UART example, which sends UART from Raspberry Pi to uh, ESP32. So those two files were added. 
uh, you can see here and here. And we took this file, ESP32, this, excuse me, this file, uh, ESP32 UART, and copied it inside our project here. It's now ESP IDF 5.0, but it's basically the same like 4.4 for the UART reading. And it's the same file that we used like a year ago. And uh, also we opened the we opened the connection to our Raspberry Pi. What you see here is a connection to to the Raspberry Pi, and you can see VNS screen. This is our Raspberry Pi, which is running live, and two uh, windows are opened. One is this with, with the VS Code. You can see the Python file here. Is this is the same file which was saved in the GitHub repository. And the bash uh, as, um, uh, window in order to run this file. On the uh, ESP side, we have on our PC ESP32 connected via USB to my PC. And so on the PC, you can see the Raspberry Pi screen and the ESP32 screen. So first we will um, uh, flash the program on the ESP32. The interesting thing that if you will uh, keep all those uh, lines connected, you will not be able to flash the program. So what I'm doing, I'm uh, detaching the uh, uh, TX RX connection the connection I will show you I am detaching uh, uh, this line this line just in order to flash the ESP32 okay Now ESP32 is being flashed and uh, uh, after it he, he will be open to receive the UART communication. Okay, so he is trying to receive the UART communication but no data have been sent yet. Uh, okay, it's some garbage. So I'm connecting back the uh, the 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 pin okay so i hope i connected it okay by the way the strings that you have seen is this string here esp data received he's just printing every second the string without any data and uh, the file have the uh, uh, URC initiation here with the bound rate, with the relevant bound rate and the relevant parameters for the uh, URC communication. And then we install the pins, the relevant pins and the relevant drivers. And then we write and uh, run an infinite loop in order to read every second, we read the data and print it on the screen. Okay, but now he is not receiving any data, so it's empty. And uh, now let's come back to the uh, screen here. Let's take to another uh, mouse. Okay, we will run the Python file. As you can see, the Python file is sending message UART uh, from Raspberry Pi 3. And as you can see here, this message is received by the ESP. So ESP is writing ESP data received and adding the received message. And so you can see live the tra transmission 
of from Linux which is running on Raspberry Pi and reception of the UART message in free RTOS on ESP32. And that's all for today. Thank you.